Remember to subscribe and hit the bell icon to never miss an update from my mums. Being pregnant is such a beautiful thing and there are so many changes happening inside and outside as well. You can see a few changes and you can't see so many changes that are actually going on inside. I, Dr. Anita Chaudhary, will tell you about the breast changes. Hi, mommies. How soon do you notice breast changes in pregnancy and what does the change look like? Breast changes are a normal part of pregnancy and occur as a result of hormonal fluctuations. Changes to the breast can occur as early as one week after conception and continue right up to the birth of the baby and beyond. Today, I, Dr. Neeta Chaudhary, will discuss the breast changes that are most common during each trimester. We also provide some tips on easing breast discomfort when pregnant. It is important to note that breast changes vary from person to person and not everyone will develop all the symptoms that I will be talking about. First trimester breast changes. During weeks 0 to 13 of pregnancy, symptoms may include 1. Tenderness and discomfort. Breast tenderness is often one of the earliest symptoms of pregnancy. Listen carefully. Breasts may become sore, heavy or a tingly sensation as early as one to two weeks after conception. The nipples may also feel sensitive and even painful to touch. These changes occur because of rising hormone levels in the body and increased blood flow to the breast tissue. Breast discomfort often subsides after a few weeks, although it may return in the later stages of pregnancy. 2. Enlargement Going up a cup size or two is normal when pregnant, especially during the first pregnancy. This growth can begin early on in pregnancy and continue throughout. Rapid growth can cause the breast to feel itchy as the skin stretches. The breast may also continue to increase in size after birth during nursing period. 3. Blue veins Blood volume typically increases by 50%. As a result, prominent blue veins usually appear on the several areas of the skin including the breast and stomach. These veins are necessary to carry the increasing blood volume and nutrients around the body to the developing fetus. Second trimester. From weeks 14 to 27, the second trimester of pregnancy may bring about a lot of changes. 1. Darker areolas. The areolas are the colored circles around the nipples. Over the course of the second and third trimester, the areolas often become larger and darker. Darkening areolas are likely to result from the hormonal changes. Often, the areola returns to its pre-pregnancy color after breastfeeding, but it sometimes remains a shade or two darker than it was originally. 2. Areola Bumps Pregnancy causes small painless bumps to appear on the areolas. These are oil producing glands called Montgomery tubercles and they lubricate the breast and promote easier breastfeeding. 3. Nipple discharge. Some women might notice nipple discharge during their second trimester. For others, this may not occur until the third trimester or after labor. Discharge can occur at any time, but it is more likely when the breasts become stimulated. This thick yellow discharge is called colostrum, a liquid that boosts the immune function of newborns in the very early stages of breastfeeding. 4. Breast Lumps Lumpy breasts affect some individuals during pregnancy. Usually, these lumps are not a cause for concern. They are often either galactoseeds, which are clogged milk ducts, or fibroadenomas, which are basically benign breast tumors. However, it is still important to tell your doctor about any breast lump that you develop. 
although the risk of breast cancer during pregnancy is very very low especially in women below the age of 35 pregnancy can make it more difficult to diagnose and treat breast cancer third trimester weeks 28 to 40 weeks of pregnancy can lead to the following breast changes one continuing growth and other changes many breast changes that occur in the first and second trimester will continue throughout the final months of pregnancy the breast can even become larger and heavier the nipples may continue to darken and the colostrum might leak more regularly two stretch marks rapid tissue growth causes the skin to stretch which may lead to stri gravidarum or stretch marks research indicates that 50 to 90 percent of pregnant women develop stretch marks on their bodies commonly on the breast stomach and the thighs these red lines typically appear in the sixth and seventh month of pregnancy but they can appear before or after that time as well three milk production breast changes occur to allow the newborn baby to feed however people do not experience dramatic breast changes during pregnancy should not worry about the ability to feed their babies nipple and breast changes are not indicative of person's ability to produce milk or breastfeed after delivery or sometimes before the breast produce small amounts of colostrum this fluid helps boost the baby's immune system newborn babies have very small stomachs and require only modest amount of colostrum to meet their nutritional needs just as less as 5 ml in each feed over the next few days the breasts begin to produce milk instead of colostrum breast milk production typically starts between day 2 to day 5 and it increases gradually anyone who has concern about their ability to breastfeed should consider seeking help support from a doctor midwife or a lactational expert four ways to ease discomfort many people experience breast discomfort during pregnancy however there are many ways for people to accommodate their changing breasts and ease discomfort during this time five wearing breast pads for leakage for colostrum leakage try wearing breast pads they're small little pads and you just apply them these are available in either a disposable or reusable form or you can just rub your breast with your palm and that secretion can stop six applying lotions and oils applying lotions or oils to the breast can relieve skin tightening and itching many people also use these products in the hope of reducing stretch marks but current research suggests that topical treatments such as cocoa butter and other oils do not prevent the formation of stretch marks instead just being patient will help as stretch marks and other skin changes usually fade after the birth of the baby seven treating blocked milk ducts a person can treat blocked milk ducts by applying a warm compress to painful blocked areas of the breast massage can also be very helpful gently massage the breast from the sore towards the nipple eight checking breasts for lumps carry out regular breast checks during pregnancy to look for lumps and bumps and speak with your doctor if you have any of these usually a lump will be benign to occur due to a blocked milk duct nine bra tips investing in a well-fitting and supportive bra is one of the best ways to ease breast discomfort during pregnancy when choosing a bra look for these particular features good support is needed wide straps are better adjustable closures remember no underwires should be worn cotton fabric is one of the best and most comfortable one and seam free design near the nipple 
sports bras and sleeve bras are also very comfortable during pregnancy you might even wear these and sleep at night many people prefer to buy nursing bras as they approach the delivery date and these nursing bras are also suitable for use during pregnancy and when you sleep it is a good idea to get a professional fitting for a bra during pregnancy because a person's bra size can change a number of times as the breasts and the chest expand 9 changes to expect after pregnancy after birth the mother's breasts will maintain the larger size due to milk production once they stop breastfeeding their breasts and nipples often return to the normal size shape and color but for some of them this will happen quickly some might take time but some mothers find that their breasts never regain their pre pregnancy size and the appearance sometimes breasts may appear droopier after pregnancy this change is more likely to appear in mothers who smoke or who have a high body mass index that is obesity larger pre pregnancy breasts and experienced number of pregnancies 10 when to contact your doctor anyone who has concerns about breast changes during or after pregnancy should speak with a doctor it is very very important to seek medical attention if breast lumps develop or if the nipples produce an unusual discharge that does not resemble colostrum these symptoms are likely to be harmless but it is always a good idea to have a doctor's opinion and now to sum it up most pregnant mothers experience breast changes due to rising hormones and increased blood volume however not everyone experiences these changes a lack of breast changes does not signify anything about the health of the pregnancy or a person's ability to produce milk or breastfeed your baby pregnancy related breast changes can be uncomfortable at times to manage the symptoms some invest in very good supportive bras apply lotions to itchy skins and wear pads for leakage most changes will reverse after the delivery of the baby or discontinuation of breastfeeding so remember nothing is permanent everything is changing during pregnancy and it will change even after delivery all that you need to do is take care of yourself and your breast because breastfeeding is the only way to feed your baby thank you and namaste Thank you.